Hi guys, welcome to Asher and Gad channel, making Africa home again, one family at a time. Trust you're all doing well, wherever you are on the four corners of this planet, making your dreams become a reality one step at a time, your dreams in the lovely continent that is Africa. It's been a while, I know, uh, haven't done a video for a long, long, long time, probably about eight weeks or so, and we have just been so, 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 so busy. In fact, we've been overrun in, in the Asher and Gad consultancy. Uh, but 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 thank thank the most high that I've managed to employ more people and now we are more stabilized and, and everything is, is a bit better now under control. So I'm back to give you uh, regular videos as much as as much as possible. Videos to help those who are building in Ghana uh, to navigate the, <laughs> the, the, the the waters uh, and, and, and also to inspire those who haven't started building yet but to really desire to build in Ghana. Okay, so that's what we're about. And uh, for those who have been my subscribers, for uh, our subscribers for a long time, you know that we have Asher and Gad Consultancy. And over the past uh, eight weeks or so, or even 12 weeks, it's been clear to me that my clients need something more, something a bit more specific. And that's what we've been, been keeping us busy. Uh, what we are offering right now is a, is a 10 key design and installation solution. Okay, a 10 key design and installation solution uh, as it relates to your electrical system design and, and the water system design. Done it, we've done it for a couple of clients uh, recently where you give us your drawings. We design the electrics and the water systems for you according to your specification. You know, we obviously we have meetings with you. We, we describe what we're doing to you in, um, in layman terms if you're not a technical, technical person. And therefore, you, 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 you get what you want on design. And we call it 10 key because it's not just about design, it's about the installation. Okay, Is it going to be installed as the design? So we also um, recommend, if you like, trusted and experienced artisans, electricians and plumbers. We've got about, we've got about three good quality electricians and at least two good quality uh, plumbers that we've been using from, from building to building and, and, and they do a good job. So, you know, we, we recommend that for you as well to bring it all, to wrap everything up. So that's a turnkey design and installation solution of the electrical and water systems as well. Okay, so if you're interested as usual, get in touch. Uh, WhatsApp calls uh, are the best, 050-625-1602. Number will be on your screen uh, at some point in this video. All right, so. Now coming to today's topic. Today's I'm gonna I'm gonna do a couple of videos really uh, talking about the water systems. Two or three videos talking about the water systems because water is very important. Um, I mean electricity is, is important as well, but water is far more important than electricity, to my mind. You know you can um, you can live without electricity for let's say you know two days or so or even more, but living without water is a big big deal. You need to, you, you need to have a bath. You need it to eat, to, to cook your food, and you need it for so many, so many reasons. So water is important. And for those of you who are, have been our long-standing subscribers, you will know that we have put a lot of investment into our water system. And there's even been more investment that we've not necessarily had a chance to, to, to bring it uh, on screen. Okay, so, you know, the, 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 we have invested a lot into our water system, definitely. And it's working amazingly now absolutely amazing but i just want to give a, a little summary um of, of how our water system works just uh, just 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 listen to this video and uh, to remind uh, yourself of how our water system works and uh, before that starts i uh, just we have a borehole okay and that borehole is a, about 100 meters into the ground and it pumps water up into a massive 10,000 liter tank okay and the water is distributed from the house from there on from there onwards but uh, listen to this video and i'll give you a nice reminder and i'll be right back so what happens this is my borehole system okay now this green pipe here this green pipe comes from the ground the borehole is behind me okay so this, this brings up water from the ground 100 meters down in the ground into this big 10,000 liter tank okay and everything is under a nice shade here roofing sheets no, no water external water gets in here so from that 10,000 liter tank at the moment what we do have is we have a one horsepower pump which is there that's the one horsepower pump it's, it's an automatic pump with the pedrillo controller on it okay so 
that pumps water from this tank into this tank through the Bumbula filter. So at the moment, that is the manual, uh, the manual head, manual valve on full filter. Okay, so that goes through that, you know, manual backwash, manual rinse as usual. That goes through that into this 5,000 litre tank, right? And then from that 5,000 litre tank, okay, we now, now use, we have an, another pump here and a, a sediment filter which then pumps up onto the roof, okay? All right, hopefully that was a, a good reminder. So, um, that's how the water system works, okay? Pumping the, pumping the ground, pumping it up to the 10,000 litre tank, pump, pumping it through the, the filtration system into the second 5,000 5, litre tank, and then from there, pumps up to the roof, to a 2,500 litre tank on the roof, and then that pumps down to the, to, to the building, cold water with the beautiful and the right amount of pressure, okay? Uh, and that is a good design. Really, even, even if there's no power, it comes down through gravity with enough pressure and that's what uh, that's what you want for me when i'm having a shower i find it very th uh, therapeutic I, I i love water you know i love the therapeutic nature of having of having a shower even having a line and if i don't have the right pressure it's it's just it's just not 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 right for me both the hot and the cold water very 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 important now obviously we've had some challenges you know I, we I, I did the design we installed it you know i, I monitored the installation you know as you, as you know um when we moved in there were some challenges uh, with with the borehole we don't have we don't have salt salt is not an issue but we did have some um some a high level of what they call total suspended solids so there's some there were some particles some small particles that would still get through the the original filter so after some time we realized that and some of you may have, may have experienced this we realized that our taps began to block and every sort of two months you'd have to you'd, you'd have to open the tap filter clean it out before the water can flow at the right pressure. Both taps and shower heads and even affected the, the washing machine and the dishwasher. They would begin to, to malfunction and you get an error to say that, oh, there's not enough water coming through because obviously the particles have blocked the, the pipe or, or, or filled the filter. You, should have, you have to just take, it, take it out, wash the filter out before the water can flow. So obviously that was a problem and um, constant cleaning so we have to find a solution. Wherever there's a problem, there's always, always, always a solution. Just that maybe you haven't found it yet. So I decided to, to, to install two sediment, sediment filters. Now the sediment filters, a uh, couple of examples on your screen, they have finer, finer, finer uh, nets, if you like, which trap smaller, small particles of, of solids or of, of, of dirt to prevent them from coming into the water system. So we installed two sediment filters, one, by the second tank and one on the roof, okay? That was one thing that made a huge, huge, huge difference, I have to say. Um, now, apart from that, you have the main filtration system, which is the, the blue cylinder you saw on your screen in the previous video, uh, in the earlier snapshot. And um, that does the main filtration. In Ghana, they call it Bumbula as well and it's really we just again it's really uh for just to get rid of the excess excess fluoride and uh some of the um l the larger particles or prevent the large, larger particles from, from coming through the issue with that is there is a um a manual system on top of the blue cylinder i'm, I'm giving you a close-up picture of that and what you have to do in order to pr to keep the, your system clean you have to manually uh Swap the, swap the position of the of the valve and I've done a video on that if you haven't watched that video please click up here to watch that video to remind yourself of what I'm talking about about twice a week is recommended twice a week depending on where you are in the country and the nature of your water once or twice a week you have to twist that valve to a if you like what they call a um, a, a backwash position where it washes the filter out of all the particles it washes it out you have to keep it there for about 20 minutes and then move it to a uh, a fast rinse position before it goes back to full normal filtration now oh my word it's fine uh, but after about after we've been in Ghana now for for two and a half years right so after about six months of doing this thing manually you know life is busy <laughs> you know family is busy and there's, a, there's some weeks where to be honest I forget I absolutely forget to do the manual filtration and then that obviously then causes problems inevitably within the home 
so that there had to be a solution. Now, being a building services consultant myself, that's what I've done for the past 21 years in the UK. You know, I have a lot of contacts in the industry, a lot of contacts in Ghana as well that I've made over the past two and a half years. And I knew that if, if I were to contact the water treatment companies, I could come up with a, a unique solution that would be far more convenient. Yes, a little bit more expensive, but far more convenient for the home. So I decided to change the manual filtration on top of the Boombola to an automatic filtration system, right? An automatic filtration system. And this has been a life saver, an absolute life saver. Okay, most I have to tell you that 90%, 95% of plumbers in Ghana, domestic plumbers in Ghana, will not know what I'm talking about. Because this type of system is used more commercially. It's used by the, the water filtration companies. Okay, so I, I got in contact with one of those companies and I purchased an automatic water filtration company. Okay, uh, uh, sorry, an automatic water filtration um, valve. It's called a clever valve. In short form, clever valve. And that goes right on top of the Boombola, okay? It replaces the manual one. It's pre-programmed. It's pre-programmed and basically what it does is you can program it such that it automatically filters your water every three days or it can automatically filter the water every seven days. You can set it exactly as how you want it to be set depending on the nature of your water. It does the backwash automatically. It does the fast rinse automatically and re-puts it on full filtration absolutely 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 wonderful wonderful and it's a dream really because i always used to forget this is automatic and i believe when i initially did that video about this about the water system and the backwash i knew there were some guys from the states who said oh this is this is a headache there has to be some automatic system available and so now there absolutely is so if you if you are still my subscriber then uh, your comment uh, drove this drove this um if you like this research and this this, this change in the home, all right? Uh, the good thing about the automatic system is that it, it's mains powered. You need to have a switch right by the uh, by the filtration, okay? And also, as we know, Ghana, there's an occasional doom saw power, power off, but the this automatic filtra uh, filtration system of valve, it has a non-volatile memory. What that means is that whether there's light off or not, if the power goes off, when the power returns, guess what? It still works in the exact same way. The program remains unaffected. It even, even the time resets to the right time in Ghana. Okay. So the non-volatile memory makes it absolutely, absolutely perfect to have. And I fully recommend that you have this automatic filtration system if your water system is similar to mine. Okay. Obviously from a cost point of view, it's, 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 it's going to be a little bit more expensive, but in, in the grand scheme of things, in the grand scheme of building your home, not really. Uh, when I bought it, which is back in July this year, so where are we now? September, so that's about, what, two months ago, two, two, two and a half months ago, it, the Clever Valve was 1,500 Ghana cities, approximately. No, 1,450, say, but let's just say 1,500 cities, approximately. Okay, so that's, that's what, that's about, about, about 100 pounds, or 100 and, $125, $130, okay, which, you know, is, is absolutely, absolutely good. All right, so... um. I'm gonna give you a bit more information, but let's just take a break right now and I'll come back, see you after the break. Are you looking to build your dream home in Ghana or are you building already? Would you benefit from regular site visits to monitor your building and receive regular progress reports? Well, if that's the case and that's you, look no further, Asher and Gag Consultancy at your service. We offer the following services, electrical design, construction monitoring inspections, site progress reports, consultation for all items MEP, witnessing of testing and commissioning, periodic snagging, vetting of specialist subcontractors. Report, we also report site activities to you to hopefully help you spend your money efficiently and much, much more. Get in contact for your building needs. Details on the screen. Asher and Gag Consultancy. Make can Africa home again, one family at a time. Hi guys, so before the break, I was talking about this automatic system, this clever valve or clev valve. Okay, and now uh, I want to say that yes, it's a lifesaver. You want to install it and not have to worry about it and know that the water is being filtered. So therefore, that convenience costs money. If you're interested in it, Get in contact and I'll, and I'll let you know where you can purchase it, okay? 
but most importantly you can purchase this valve but like i said 90 to 95 percent of plumbers domestic plumbers in ghana do not know what this is i've not seen it before i had to coach um uh, my, my my plumbers on how to get it installed but now they are experts at it i guess that's that's one beauty of being in ghana for two and a half years i've established a team of electricians who are, i've trained and they're, they're quite good the same thing goes with the plumbers so if you want this if you want to purchase this no problems i'll, I'll get you the, the, the plumber the right plumber who can do a good job for you and make sure it's installed correctly all right okay guys um so yeah if you have a if you have a plumber uh that's fine uh but if you don't have a, a good plumber then you can contact my my, my experienced plumber his name is steven telephone number on your screen zero five four three six eight double uh double nine nine five or triple nine five as zero five four three six eight triple nine five his name is steven steven tete just just let him know you got the got he's got he's got his numbers from asher and gad um he, he knows how to install it he even knows where, to, where, where exactly where to buy because he knows where the company is uh, and he, he can sort that out for you um all right so i hope you enjoyed this short video uh we're now back again uh, and we really want to bring more context more useful content for those who are building in ghana or those who wish to build as usual guys please like share subscribe hit that notification button so you always be aware when asher and gad upload a new and educational video for your viewing content all right or for your viewing pleasure sorry it's been a long time i said that <laughs> forgotten <laughs> but uh, hopefully we're, we're, we're back now all right guys hope you enjoyed that so from gad it's chemist here and for me guys yebeshia See you next time.